Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another baby clothing haul for you. Arla's just gone into three to six months clothing now and I bought a load of stuff when I was pregnant. I pulled it out the other day and realised how cute it is so I wanted to share it with you. Even though I bought a lot when I was pregnant, I've still been shopping because we all know I have a problem when it comes to baby clothes and I've picked up some really cute things lately from Mams and Papas, Morrisons, places like that. I find the supermarkets are really good lately for baby clothes. So I'm just going to go through some of the bits. I won't show you absolutely everything. I know I've literally just uploaded a baby clothing haul, but I just like to share where I get his stuff from, just in case anyone's looking or you want to know what's out there at the moment. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it and subscribe to my channel for weekly videos. Jumping into the box right next to me, I've got some bits from Morrison's. When I went there, I was so impressed. This stuff is so cute and it's really affordable in Morrison's as well. I know a lot of the supermarkets have their own baby clothes, but I definitely think Morrison's have the best selection and the best prices. So really basic, I just got some socks. Some of them have frills on and some don't, but they're just in these lovely spring summer colors. And then I got this really cute romper, which was five pound. So it's just like a little play suit, shorts on the bottom, sleeveless, perfect for summer. And I love the color. And I also picked it up in age two to three for my niece Kylie, because I love for them to wear matching clothes. I then got these really cute packs so tops and leggings both in a three pack i love this green the tops have just got really cute embroidery on and little collars and then we've got some daisies i do think the middle one looks a little bit like a tea towel but you know i'm sure it'll look cute on her and there's the matching leggings just yellow daisies and then the tea towel print it was 14 pound for this set altogether. Obviously you don't have to buy both if you've already got like plain leggings for example but I just thought they were really lovely. I said this in my last clothing haul but I flipping love babies in pyjamas that aren't baby grows so they look like adults pyjamas or older kids pyjamas. I just think they look so mini and lush when they wear them so because it's going to get warmer while she's wearing three to six months. I got these really lightweight ones and these have a cropped leg. They were six pounds and they just have this lovely floral print. It reminds me of Kath Kidston stuff. The little like bloomer shorts, really lovely material, really soft and thin for summer. And then I got these pajamas with bunnies and flowers on. I'm trying not to talk too much about each thing because I have a really bad habit of it. And when I'm editing my videos, I think, oh my God, literally just shut up. So if I seem like I don't care and I'm just going through each thing really quickly, I am, it's just to stop me rambling and just so you can see the item and you know where it's from. They're the main two things I'm trying to get out in this video. So again from Morrison's, an all-in-one, but I call these like daytime baby grows. It's knitted, but it's still lightweight with some embroidery on the front. Another supermarket which is pretty good for baby clothes is Sainsbury's. Today she's wearing a little set from there and it's really cute like a little romper because it was warm today. They didn't have a big selection when I went in but online they have loads of stuff and I saw this set online, went in and got it. So it's like a safari animal print set. So you get three tops, short sleeve tops, says tiny and happy, lots of cute animals on there and then one in a different colour and then you can mix and match these with the shorts. So these are the same as the top, like the exact same print and colour as one of the tops or you've just got the basic like burgundy mini little shorts. She has a photo shoot next month which I'm so excited for. It was meant to be a newborn one but it got cancelled so the lady said she does have some little rompers and outfits but not really in three to six. She only has a couple of things because she specialises in newborn and then older kids so she's asked me to bring my own stuff which is absolutely fine. I did find it quite difficult to find cute things because she said not to put her in a dress because if she's in like a big frilly dress it'll lift up, she'll be playing with it and that's not really ideal when you're trying to take some nice photos like when she's laying down and stuff so I think I'm just going to put her in like little rompers but I found this knitted set in Matalan so it's the knitted jumper with a little frill around the neck or a collar 
and then it goes down into little knitted shorts and it's just plain which is what I wanted for the photo shoot I didn't want her in anything with like a pattern or a logo or anything on it and then from Matalan I got this romper because it was quite minimal just a baby pink one with a bow around the middle another pair of pyjamas these almost look too nice to be pyjamas they're from Laura Ashley and they're just so sweet I think I could get away with putting her in this in the daytime to be honest it's really pretty so it's just a long sleeve top such nice detail and it's got poppers down the one side and then the bottoms a really cute frill and a bow around the bottom I just checked the label and they're not actually pyjamas it says cardigan and pants set I feel like when I bought them they were on the pyjama section but no that is an outfit I did think they were too nice to wear to bed to be honest these are the romper style things that I was talking about so next do really good ones this is a pack of four just lovely floral prints frill sleeve and next just have the loveliest like colours and designs oh I remember buying this set when I was pregnant and just imagining like what my baby would look like and imagining a little girl in this outfit and now obviously she's here I just can't wait to put her in it so it's like a little blouse it's very creased because it's been in a storage container but it's a blouse leggings and headband set so this is the blouse I love anything that looks a little bit old-fashioned when it comes to baby clothes it's got some little flowers on there's the headband with a little bow on and then the floral leggings these are still in the bag but again from next I love buying sets of things so instead of just one outfit I think it's better value for money to buy like three tops and three leggings like the ones from Morrison's sorry guys I knew little Madden by here would wake up when I was filming I've literally been putting it off all day because she's been so grisly with her teeth in bless her and she just looked flat out so I started filming and here she is why the weight club I like to buy sets of things so a few tops and a few bottoms and it's nice because a lot of the time they do mix and match so I got these tops from next she had these as a newborn but there's a spotty one and a floral one I know it's difficult to see sorry and then for £11 you have the matching leggings I do try to buy stuff that isn't just pink floral and bunny rabbits I promise but it is really hard not to when it's so cute but one thing I did get because I thought it makes a change from that sort of vibe that I normally go for is this set from M&S and I can't really describe the colour it's like a creamy colour with these little birds on and it's got little ribbed green leggings to match the colour on the top how cute I forgot to say as well the H&M stuff is four to six months I did say in my last video they do it in two months instead of three it's really hard to show you one handed but I got this set it's a top with bunnies on and the little matching like woodland bottoms and they're cuffed like joggers and then again from the H&M conscious range I just got a plain pink long sleeve top which comes with these really cute bunny bottoms as you can see there is a theme and these have got the feet on as well for when it's a little bit colder these still have the cardboard in so it's going to be a bit hard to show you but from Asda I got these really cute Winnie the Pooh pyjamas so tops and bottoms really love Winnie the Pooh stuff she has got some Winnie the Pooh vests and baby grows that she's just grown out of and one of the first things Ryan bought her was a Winnie the Pooh sleeping bag but Winnie the Pooh they normally do like white with the yellow or the red or grey and white so I was happy to find Winnie the Pooh in some girly colours. From TK Maxx I got these two matching sets like two of the same but they didn't come together I bought them separately. So they're just baby grows but what I call again daytime baby grows little outfits with a frill on the shoulder and I can't remember what you call this like I think it's like Dobby material and then they come with the matching headband so I got pink one and so when she's older she doesn't think that shops only ever sold pink clothes I did get this turquoise one and I have got the headband somewhere but I can't reach it right now I got this top and shorts with like little braces from Matalan and I forgot about this I might actually use these little knitted shorts for a photo shoot I went into Mamas and Papas and they had a sale on so I got a pack of three baby grows 
with a lovely like summery design on and they were reduced to £11 from 22 and I got these little trousers sort of like joggers in the sort of blush pink colour and then this lush bunny top with a little bow in the ear how cute and then that matches the joggers I got that to go with the joggers and then I saw this top which is literally the perfect colour and it's just got a lace collar and then just as I was leaving I thought oh my god how did I miss this there say hi everyone I just wanted to be on camera look at all your clothes this coat wasn't in the sale it was 29 pounds this is like a proper coat I would wear this myself how lush is that it's got the buttons going down the collar and it's just a lovely material it's still quite thin but obviously I'll keep her warm with the outfit on underneath and it is just the perfect match for this little set here or even the bunny top my leg is actually going dead now because I've been sat down yeah. with them crossed and now I've got the baby on me <laughs> and my gums have been hurting me all day yes so I'm not too happy today everyone but thanks for looking at my clothes I know that was a lot of stuff and I just sort of ran through it all but just in case anyone's expecting a little girl or has got a little girl and you want to know what's in the shops or online then there we go i hope this helped i hope you enjoyed the video if you did give it a thumbs up like i said let me know what other videos you want to see from me or if you want to see any more from arla because as i'm filming this i've just edited a really long vlog with this cheeky girl in thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video say bye 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 guys <laughs>